hello everyone welcome to chemistry art so in this video i am going to show you that how to check out the positive ion in a given inorganic salt so in the salt there is a positive charge and there is the negative charge so which positive ion is present we can find out with the help of the flame test so for that we have here concentrated hydrochloric acid then uh, this is a salt and a watch glass and uh, this is a salt which we are going to check out then uh, this is a dropper okay then the very important thing is the platinum wire okay here you have to make a loop of it then the burner okay so now let's start the flame taste so here you have to make a small loop on the end of the platinum wire so that you can uh, take the mixture of hydrochloric acid and salt in it and then that loop we have to heat in the oxidizing flame of the burner so here you can see that it's a loop it is prepared now i'll take a pinch of salt okay if the salt is not crushed you can crush it with the help of glass roll okay and then after make a paste you need to make a paste in concentrated hydrochloric acid and for that it is very important that uh, salt should be in small particle form okay so now i am taking salt and i will add slide concentrated acid to make a paste of my salt okay so i have already turned on the burner and uh, now we will check out that which positive ion is there actually when we are mixing salt and uh, hydrochloric acid it is forming the halide and halide if particular metal halide is present it will give you a particular colored frame so with the help of that color you can identify which positive ion is present so first of all we need to clean the platinum wire and for that we can use the hydrochloric acid as you can see here i am cleaning the uh, platinum wire and now after that i will take a very small amount of my paste of the salt on the loop of the platinum wire and then like this we need to heat it so here you can see the color you can see the red color okay let me show you again you can also use cobalt i see here it's a red color brick red color you can also use cobalt glass okay from cobalt glass you can reduce the extra yellow flame we are generally not considering the yellow flame and here you can see it is giving the crimson red color so it is showing the presence of calcium ion you have to remember the color so here red color is nothing but it's showing that salt contain calcium ion now i am cleaning the platinum wire because i am going to show you the flame test for another salt also so in this video i'll show you three salts flame test okay so while you are performing another salt taste you need to clean it with the help of concentrated acid and now this is concentrated so hydrochloric acid i had added into salt so i have now this is paste and i am going to dip my platinum wire into it and let's check out the flame here you can see the green color okay it's a grassy green color which is showing that the salt contain barium ion so remember that the barium will show you the grassy green color flame okay so first we have check out calcium giving the red color flame barium grassy green and this is the third salt i have added the concentrated hydrochloric acid and the paste is ready but before it once again you have to clean the platinum wire with the help of concentrated acid and here you can see that 
here it is giving the pink is violet color and it is showing that the potassium salt means potassium ion is present in this salt